Alright guys, so what's up guys, Bonnie's back though today, got a really, 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 really quick, um, duck about video one to do it really quick, it is going to be 10 years long, but yeah, we did some stuff of course for V-Jump, we got some new stuff of course, leaks, all that stuff, um, for 10 about it for JP for 2020, so, um, that's good though of course, um, I was going to say 2019, but last year, last year, last year, thoughts, but um, yeah, of course, um, I mean like, thoughts of last year, you know, stuff like that, I don't know, just, I have 2019 on the brain, I don't know why, yeah, of course, we got some new info, leaks, stuff like that, of course. Um, of course, for JP, stuff like that. Yeah, we are getting the Gogeta and Vegeta, they are coming back. We always get 10 about a tease. I think last year was Gohan, Goten, and Ella Burley last year, I think. Oh, was that last year? Oh, no, again, it didn't probably get some of that video, so. Oh, uh, yeah, it's been about a long time. Of course, the Dragon Ball Legends, we are getting some new stuff as well. I'll um, show it to Miguel right here. He's, um, I think, a Legends Dan Miner. Um, I think he just came up out of the blue nowhere, but, um, yeah, um, we are getting a new blue Goku, of course, blue Vegeta. From the Goku Black arc, of course, I'm gonna go over that all really quick. Um, we got images up here, of course, I'm gonna go over that really quick, because I already do that. Um, can I zoom in really quick? Let me zoom in a little bit more. Um, he is pretty good, where it is. Um, but yeah, of course, oh, actually, perfect. Um, but yeah, of course, we have blue Gogeta and blue Vegeta. I mean, nothing that really much here. It's saying, oh, yeah, you can do it, go pick up all of the LR. So new, but yeah, this image right here is bright. I'm sorry about that. Um, of course, um, you can again, uh, just, I like to talk about training items, like, oh, yeah, you can get training items and stuff like that, you know, probably like the Tanabar wishes and stuff like that. So, like, yeah, yeah, you can get training items, grant guys, um, orbs, not orbs, but um, Herco statues and stuff like that. Of course, this is the Tanabar, the Strip of Wish. We'll be getting a lot of those. I think it's like you can get seven overall or eight. I think because um last year we had like ten of our wishes, Purunga, all that stuff last year. Guys, no, Purunga, um he is a um, you know Nemic Dragon, so I had of course you know we had three wishes and stuff like that. Um, cause you get I would get like triple wish, you can get more of those like go to the barber shop, get seven seven units and stuff like that. So yeah, I'm gonna go over that when that comes out. Cause again, the list is always usually updated or up to date usually. So yeah, there's a lot of stuff for ten of our, So um, it's a JP celebration. I was celebrating in Japan. They had like food festivals, all that stuff. So yeah, that's the official thing. Did I what did I even know about? It's like what. I think 2018, that's when um, we got full power to the same for Goku. He was Tanabata for 2018. 2019 was, um, I think it was Gohan, Goten, and El Arboli. Tech El Arboli last year. Um, so yeah, again, they do it every year. What well, that makes sense is that time slot and stuff like that. That's where, um, Global, of course, you know, got El Arboli, Gohan and stuff like that already. I mean, they already had it, but simple cool stuff like that. Um, but yeah, of course, um, that is like really, you know, Santa Bottom and stuff like that. So that's kind of cool though. I'm um, gonna see. So yeah, for global players, when this comes out for global, um, which should be on November. It's always, no, we always get November, our Thank Celebration and Santa Bottom. We always get that for, um, global for, um, in November. So yeah, like, I think when this boo, um, and this Gotenks comes out for November for global, this November 2020, uh, we'll get these guys. Um, so yeah, um, we're gonna go back on that, um, so yeah, um, <laughs> wrong one though, but yeah, um, they're gonna be available with coins, which essentially that means, yeah, they're gonna be available with coins, the strip of wishes right here, so we're gonna see that more, and, um, you know, when it comes out, something like that, again, though, you can, um, get, you can do missions, you'll get seven overall, which you can, you'll get, like, 77, you can get, actually, let me go real quick, so the strip of wish is, you know, you can get it, um, as you know, really the notifications, um, you can get them, um, as you, like, you know, press them, just go for it. Um, you can get them as, you know, you play the game and stuff like that, missions, rewards, also vlogging bonuses, you'll get those as, like, you know, for, like, the next few days and stuff like that. As you do that, you'll, um, get them more and more and more, the more you get, you can go in the Baba Shop, get 77, um, SSRs, there's, like, 77 SSRs, but you can get 7 out of 77. Um, I think it's, like, 5, because you can do 5, but if you wish, you'll get, like, I think 3 more, so, you get 8 slash 7, I think. That's how it is. That's how it's really structured. So yeah, we get promo wishes. I'll go over them all, all of them every single day. Like I usually do. Those are like those, those videos are like what two, three minutes long usually. So doesn't usually take that long though for those videos. But yeah, um, again, we should be seeing we should be seeing you guys soon for video and stuff like that. Of course, I had the strip of wish again though. You'll get um, it'll be like you know I'll explain stuff like that when it comes out because you know you can go to the barber shop, you get them through missions. Um, that that no, but you know you'll get them missions, long roses and stuff like that. Um, from Prune Glaciers, you actually get a three more triple wishes, so you can go in the barber shop. Again, though, get seven, you can get seven SSRs out of 77. Um, and, you know, some of them are usually good. They do change up the list every year. I remember, I think, last two years, they just changed a few units. They haven't changed that much, though, but they're saying Go Vegeta and Vegeta will be, um, Blue Gogeta and Vegeta, the Blue Fusions, they will be back again, though, on the, um, Ten of Honor Banner, that's what it's saying right here. They always do this no matter what. So that might be just them, because it usually comes up with like a new unit. We always usually get a new unit and a new Doku Fest unit. Like for full power Super Saiyan 4 Goku, they put him on the Ten of Honor Banner for 2018. They put him on the banner with the LRs. Go Hunt, Go Ten did it for global for Christmas and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, just a lot of stuff like that for Ten of Honor. Like, um, I'm trying to think of it. Back in like what? I think, yeah, because Go Hunt and Go Ten. I like Go Hunt and Go Ten. They didn't come out like, we got, that's, um, Global got that for like what? Ten of Honor for. 
Um, I don't know, it's confusing. There's a lot to go over that, for that. Um, because for um, Global 2019, um, for Christmas stuff, like, that was our Christmas banner. The Tana Bada banner for LR Gohan and Goten was for Christmas. Um, they, they moved that up for Global, which I kind of get done in context. I kind of get that. Um, Sorry, that's just talking notifications. Oh, sorry about that. Oh, sorry, text me. But um, yeah, though, I was gonna say um, yeah um, cause actually again, there could be available coins on the banner. That's what I was saying right here. Cause again, though, um, I think so. Super, Super Saiyan Four Power Goku was on the banner for 2018, and they um used um these LR Go Gita and Vegeta, the old ones, the physical int. Um, they were on that banner. Gohan and Goten, LR Gohan and Goten, and for Global for LR Gohan and Goten, and for for the Super Saiyan Fours. They were on that banner last year. Um, they were on that banner. I think it showed up, by the way. And then, of course, for Dragon Ball Legends, we are getting a new Blue Goku from the Goku Black arc, and a new Blue Vegeta from the Goku Black arc as well. Um, because again, you can tell about Gal Gun and stuff like that. You know, far as on Gal Gun. And add the Blue Goku again, though, it is, could you tell? Because that's when Goku, basically when Goku Black and Zawasu pinned him down, they're like, hey, I killed Chi Chi and Goten. Yeah, but then Goku went for him, right? You can tell from the art right there. So yeah, um, that's cool, though. Um, again, though, and they are sparking and stuff like that. I think Goku's, because you can, okay, yeah, they don't usually tell the, um, Color. It looks like he's gonna be red. It looks like he's gonna be um yellow. It looks like that, but probably not. Under speculation, yeah, it's Vegeta from the Goku Black card. You can tell because I think that's him charging at Goku Black and stuff like that. Um, because uh, that's when um Vegeta first goes blue against um Trunks when you're when they're training and stuff like that. So yeah, um yeah, they're here just telling you, like, yeah, you can use God Key Team, you can do this, you can do that, Legends and stuff like that. Of course, you know, typical Legends and stuff like that. So yeah. Um, that's pretty cool though for Legends, this really is hype though, because again, I mean, because that's the anniversary. Um, again, another guy keep up, because you have to go with LR, you have the um, new Sparking Vegeta, best unit in the game. And of course, you have these two guys, these two guys as well, so, really good buff for God Key. It's insane. But yeah, um, God Key though, getting another good buff. Um, they didn't really need it, but, I mean, hey, I mean, context and stuff like that, but yeah. Um, again, this is how it was um, for JP for Tanabata last year and stuff like that. Again, this is what I was talking about. Global well, got this banner for Christmas. It looks the same. Yeah, they put um, all the LRs on here. So, this is how it's going to be for Gogeta and Vegito. Then they could put like a new Joker Fest out. Because we always get a new Dan Bana um, Joker Fest unit every year. So, we're going to be yeah, for um, JP was Kid Goku. And oh no, it was, Gohan, it was LR Gohan and Goten. Kid Goku was just on the banner. So, yeah, LR Gohan and Goten. And that they were on this banner. So, yeah, when we get like a Joker Fest unit, it'll be like, oh no, like. We get like a new Android 21. No, it's, it's usually Saiyan, usually, because we got Fupar Goku. Or Gohan and Goten. Oh, it'd be like what? Like a Super Saiyan 3 Goku right here? It'll, it, um, then after that, he'll be on this banner. I'm just putting up him as an example. So we, we have like a new Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Then they put him on they put him on this banner with the LRs. So they'll go with Gina and Vegito. They're going to be on this banner. They're going to be available with coins too. So for old players, for November, make sure. Save, um, you want to go ahead and save your coins and stuff like that. It's perfect. We already know they're kind of confirming coming back. So for gold players, again, the Blue Vision will be back in November on this banner. Well, you know, let's switch up, put on Christmas again. But, um, yeah, though, for JP, is going to be, for Global, it's going to be on the 11th, 11 11. They always do it no matter what. Uh, this is how it's going to be structured for Global again, though. Um, we didn't get the Tampa banner because that came out for Christmas for Global. So, um, that's that. Um, yeah, this is how, this is how I was talking about right here. Um, Global got like a thank you to the Wish gift. This is how the Stripper Wish is going to be right here. We got Kunga Wishes. Uh, again, you can do three wishes. It'll be like a whole bunch of like, just wishes, like Kai's. Um, training items, poor items, again, the typical stuff we get every year. This is what I was kind of talking about for the, um, Stripper Wish right here. This is how the Stripper Wish is going to be structured. The Stripper Wish will be right here, but you can get them, like, do, like, celebrations, like, just, again, like, characters, all that stuff. Uh, you get, like, special characters, you can get, like, everything. Not everything, but you can get, like, special characters, you can get, um, you know, 77 SSRs out of, like, what? You can get 7 out of 77 SSRs for free, by the way, um, from the Stripper Wish. This is how, that's how it's going to be structured for JP. And stuff like that. Again, when it comes down, we're going to go over it more detailed. But, um, yeah. And of course, right here again, though, um, this is how it's gonna be structured for global and stuff like that. So that's gone um, pretty cool though, there. Um, but yeah, though, um, is that open the blue fusions? I know the right here and stuff like that. This is how the blue fusions are gonna be. Again, you know, these guys are gonna be both in the um, bobber shop and stuff like that. They're both incredibly insane. So yeah, they're gonna be the bobber shop, by the way. So yeah, again, though, you can, um, again, they're gonna be all like on this type of banner anyway. They're gonna be like a tad of banner, um, with like the new token, like with the new LR, not LR, but a new um, token fest unit. And they're gonna be on that banner, so um, that's pretty good for global. It's gonna be like November, so global players won't have to wait that long that much. So, yeah, Tampa is gonna be good for global again. The lesson using November, so yeah, that's pretty good for V-Jump, though. We got some pretty good V-Jump stuff this time. Um, so yeah, we got the Blue Goku and Blue Vegeta from the Goku Black arc coming to um, of course, um, Legends, so it's cool. Um, for them, another good buff for God Key because the Legends anniversary was so good, it was yeah, it really was good though. Like, yeah, we got good, um, LR 
the LF Vegeta, which everybody's in mom still is going crazy for, over for. But, um, yeah, it's pretty good, though, for, um, you know, JP and stuff like that. Again, they're going to be available with red coins. So, basically, you can summon stuff like that, get red coins. Boom, they're going to be available. Because um, last year, I think they were um, for, for Super Saiyan 4, Goku, and Vegeta. They were available with, um, red coins. So, again, they're going to be just like this. They're going to have, like, they're going to be available with red coins. So, for global players, this is going to be November. They always do this in November, no matter what. So, it's probably thinking celebration of Tanabata. For no, who knows? Who, we know. We could, no, they never change that. They never change that time slot. So, this is going to be on 11 11 for global. For JP, it's going to be on the J July 1st. And I think JP and global can get their, you know, get ahead into their anniversary. So, yeah, it's going to be you know, really busy because JP is going to get Tanabata and global is going to get their anniversary stuff. Um, pretty insane times right now for um, global and JP right now. So, yeah. Get you know, the contest gonna be at the same time and stuff like that, of course. But yeah, you know, they're gonna be available with coins. Make sure to get them and stuff like that. They're really worth it. They're both the best units in the game. I think Vegeta's a little bit better than Gogeta because uh, cause I can gain that additional attack. But again, you know, they're both, uh, I'm not gonna say I don't care. Yeah, because I don't care. Because they're both the same, they're both exactly the same units. So they're both number one in my opinion. So yeah. I feel like Vegeta, again, though, Vegeta's like, a, I mean, again, they're both, I feel like they're both number one. And then, like, months later, it's like, oh, yeah, Gogeta's gonna be number one. But yeah, no, both of them are really good. They're both the best units in the game. I don't care what anybody says, they're both number one, in my opinion. But yeah, so I really want to go to those today. Again, though, we got some new Tanabata stuff coming for JP. That's Triple Wish. We got, um, Ella, Gogeta, and Vegeta coming back with um, coins. They're gonna be on the Tanabata banner, again, though. They should be, again, though, sooner or later, because that's how the banner's gonna be. Again, Blue Fusion is gonna be on there. The new LR, the new um, Duck Fest unit, I keep saying LR. The new Duck Fest unit will be on here for Global. Again, though, they might change it up again. They might say this guy for December. They might choose to be there for December, because they did that last year. They're saving it up. So we didn't know it was gonna come out. So we were like, oh my gosh, where's the banner? But it's like, oh, yeah, they saved it for Christmas. But yeah, again, they can send up the do the same thing this year there for Christmas. If they do that, then Global's gonna hit number one. Like, because, you know, because last year, you gotta do Duck Fest um, first. Uh, no, Global first. So yeah, again, it was gonna be for Global 11 11. So yeah. Um, but yeah, you know, we don't know if Global could change again. Could be for Christmas, could be for Tanabal. So yeah. Um, that's really it though. So yeah, lots of new stuff coming up for JP. Just lots of new stuff. Oh, Goji and Go Vegeta are coming back. Dragon Ball Legends is getting um, more God Keep Us with the Goku Block arc on Vegeta and Gogeta. No, Vegeta and, and Vegeta and Goku. So you know, another Vegeta <laughs> from that arc. Um, LF Samasu, Mir Samasu, I'm joking though. Yeah, Corpus Samasu. Jeff from Mikro Dima Tomasu. I'm joking though. Yeah. See you guys later though. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Great uh, all cool jump again though. So we got the V Jump links. Um they came up a little bit early today. So yeah. What do you guys think? We got some good stuff for both of these guys. Um hopefully I went over everything as best as I could though. But yeah, see you guys later though. Again though. Peace out.